Help with Microsoft Teams setup and installation demo. Install Help with Teams by clicking on the Apps icon in Teams and searching in the App Store search bar to find Help. After finding Help in the store, click on the drop-down arrow next to Open and select Add to a Team. From the provided search finder, look up and select a public place for requesters to submit tickets and click Set up a bot. Once your public request place is selected, there will be a chat notification from Help. Click on the chat, a message will appear to view and approve Help. Submit your username and password, then click Accept to the terms. Once approved, you will then see a Welcome to Help message in your chat with Help. Now you need to create a dedicated private team space where all of your requests will come in. If you don't already have a dedicated private location, start one by creating it from scratch. Make sure it is private for just your team of agents. You'll be charged based on how many agents are in this team. Additionally, make sure the team is named so your team can identify where your tickets will appear and click Create. Once your private team is created, add help to the team by visiting the App Store. Click on the drop-down arrow and select Add to a team. Select the new private team you just created and click Set up a bot. Then go back to your chat with help and click on Select triaged team. Pick the new private team you just created so help knows who your agents are. Then hit Apply. The chat with help will send you a new message, letting you know you have set up your triage team. Help will also send a message to your dedicated triage channel, letting you know it is set up. Making a ticket in Microsoft Teams with help. When employees have questions or support requests, they can create a ticket with the Help Message extension on a message or from their Message Composer. Once they click on the Help Message extension, a dedicated form will pop up for the requester to fill out. When the form's fields are updated, the requester then clicks Create to initiate the ticket. After that, the requester will see a notification from Help about their recently created ticket. The requester can reply on the ticket. The additional information will be synced with the ticket from the agent's perspective receiving the ticket. Once created, the ticket will route to the correct team and channel. The agent can reply, assign the ticket, or view the ticket in Help web app. The agent can reply on the ticket, and the message will sync directly back to the requester, who will get notified about the update. The requester will also be notified of the agent's comments on the ticket to giving an update in Teams. The agent can then give an update on the request status letting them know everything has been checked and it's all set to go. The agent can also close the ticket in Teams or view it in the Help Web. Help's Web is where the ticket can be reviewed, managed, closed and more. This is also where all of your Help settings, custom forms, fields and queues live. Learn more about Help today by visiting help.com's Teams integrations page.